riding on my way Finally woke up with some luck in the buck I don't give a what someone, someone say Finally got my friends in the back on my roller We gon' make it big one day We gon' make it big, I say We gon' make it big, just stay in the Stay in the moon Stay in the moon with me Since you got lost in November See it in your eyes when we leave for the night Way too many heartbreaks still on your mind Let the flame burn down for a while Let the flame burn out for a while Stay in the moment Stay in the moment with me Give you a moment to Give you a moment with me Smell all the roses Smell all the roses with me finished out this wig and this is what I got if you're interested in the details and specs and all of the good things about this unit then please continue to watch okay y'all so I know some of you guys are like Chris what <laughs> what you guys may have or may have not ever seen me in a, a salt and pepper wig I have done one before if I can find the picture I'll insert it here I will do salt and pepper hair here and there because I, I have uh, older women too that follow me as well as if you guys may or may not know uh, I was raised by my grandmother and at this point my grandmother has decided to shave her hair she does her hair is very similar to this hair which is crazy uh, except that it was always real long like it used to always come like down here and she would just cut it off and wear it in a bob or a pixie cut so um and these days, uh, she's on oxygen, and it's just easier to keep a shorter look. And she likes a nice wig now. So I would, I got it, um, and I was like, you know what? I'm probably not going to wear a salt and pepper wig, <laughs> even though, honey, chef's kiss. Even though I'm not going to wear a salt and pepper wig, probably not. Uh, my grandmother does wear a salt and pepper wig, as well as I, my new grandmother-in-law. Like, uh, she is into wigs here and there. So it's like somebody will benefit from this wig. So, um, and I love it. I'm not going to hold you guys. Like, I know this is not my typical style, but um, just the, the overall styling of this unit makes it very easy to style and wear, especially for older people. So let me just go ahead and get into the details and specs on this unit. So on the site, it says, Boss by salt and pepper layered Bob glueless pre-cut minimalist lace wig. So that's another thing with this particular wig. It did come with pre-cut lace. Um, it is just one of those side part wigs and it is a closure. I feel like all of that makes it very beginner friendly and great for uh older people like uh, my grandmother or, or whoever you know these days honey uh, the young girl will bust out in a nice gray in a salt and pepper we uh we don't care honey okay we don't care but i am bordering on that age nowadays well i don't think i'm going to you know but but <laughs> the super young girlies will do it so it says the density is 150 percent it is it can be worn glueless i don't know if you guys pay attention to how this unit look when I put it on without any adhesive, honey? Mm, chef's kiss, girl, okay? She did not disappoint. Uh, the cap size is medium. The hairline's pre-cut. The color is salt and pepper. It is a left 
left C part wig uh, is minimal lace, minimalist lace. Uh, it's it's the regular lace. Uh, it can yes, it can be dyed, but bleaching is not recommended. So I want to clarify that bleaching is not recommended, and it can last for one year uh, with proper care or possibly more. I would say more. Um, and yeah, those are the details and specs. Now, for me with this wig, this wig did not require anything. And I feel like, you know, they're saying this regular lace, but I feel like this lace melted and I did not add any mousse coloring or anything to it. I feel like it just melted effortlessly. Uh, I did pop some curls and flip it a little bit more uh, after having it pinned up from putting on my makeup. Uh, but it did come pre-curled and pre-styled. And you guys know I love that. I love that because a lot of human hair units do not. So I definitely, that is like my favorite part of this unit is that how it came pre-styled and pre-layered and all that good stuff. Um, Shedding and tangling. I didn't notice any. I'm sure at some point it will, but I haven't noticed any straight out of the packaging. And uh, as far as it being big head friendly, I think you can make this unit work across the board. But in my opinion, it feels a little snug, honey. So I would say it's more small to medium head friendly than medium to large head friendly. But I think you may be able to make it work across the board because I think it may be the elastic band that makes it, makes it feel more snug because that. It's, it's, it's pretty snug with that elastic band. So I think you can maybe even it out where it doesn't feel quite as snug. Um, and yeah, I think that is pretty much it as far as the details and space go. If you're interested in my pros and cons, well, it's 4360 girl, then please continue to watch. All right, y'all. So we're going to start with the cons, but I like to end on a high note. Um, I honestly could not think of a con for this unit, y'all. Like, I'm not going to hold you. I couldn't think of a con. This this unit is conless, in my opinion. If y'all can think of one, sound off down below in the comments. <laughs> my pros is, I think this is the perfect, ultimate, perfect wig for the older lady. Or even the young girlies that, that don't mind a little salt and pepper, honey. I don't mind gray, but I think salt and pepper is more of an older lady thing but honey you can make anything fashionable okay girl <laughs> let's keep it about we can make anything fashionable um uh, i love the color i love that it came pre-styled i love that it is complete minimal minimal uh work when it comes to this unit it's like i said the ultimate beginner friendly wig in my opinion so yeah those are my pros Yes, I would definitely recommend this wig. I would recommend it to anyone. I really want it in a different color. I'm not going to hold y'all. I love this bob. This bob is bobbing. I love the texture because I don't think I mentioned that the texture is more of a yakky texture, which to me gives it more of a realistic look. I love that with this unit. Um, and so, like I said, yes, I would definitely, definitely recommend this wig. All right, y'all, I'm going to give y'all this full 360, and we can wrap this thing all the way up. So this is obviously the unit in the front. This is it on the left side. This is it in the back. And this is it on the right side. All right, y'all, so y'all let me know down below what you guys think about this unit. Let me know if you are feeling it. Does the look, is the vibe. Sound off down below in the comments. I'm interested in your thoughts and opinions. Once again, shop you love me for sending me this unit and sponsoring this video. It is truly, truly, truly appreciated. And um, if you guys are interested in purchasing this unit, I will have a direct link to it down below in the description box for your convenience. And yeah, girl, <laughs> that's all. That's all. So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed, well, click that subscribe button. It's not going to cost you not one red cent. And if you're not already following me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and TikTok. I'm Helen Missy on Snapchat. And I'm Disastrous B on Twitter. And I will see you, love folks, next time. Bye.